I'm Jim Carter with your WCCM News Talk video headlines for this Tuesday, September the 25th. Louis Figueroa, a fugitive from Salem, New Hampshire, was arrested yesterday morning by U.S. Marshals after he was found hiding at the South Lawrence home of former Lawrence police officer and local nightclub owner Raphael Bimude. Salem in Selectman took nearly five hours last night to finally adopt their proposed budget for 2013. The proposal will now move on to the Budget Committee before heading to voters in March. Local businessman Tim Coco has been nominated by Haverhill Mayor James Fiorentini to be the city's newest licensed commission member. Coco recently ran unsuccessfully for the Democratic nomination in the first Essex Senate race to fill the vacated seat of Senator Stephen Bedore. An internal poll commissioned by Republican John Golnick's campaign suggests he's trailing U.S. Representative Nikki Sangas by only seven points. According to Golnick, he's closing that gap. According to Sangas' campaign, the poll's a joke. The continuing threat of eastern equine encephalitis and West Nile virus has prompted the town of North Andover to order additional spraying on the school grounds and playing fields in order to kill mosquitoes. Spraying began last night, it continues tonight, and will also continue tomorrow on Wednesday. Amtrak is looking to match the fastest speed ever attained on a U.S. rail line. The Accela Express is expected to reach 165 miles per hour during test runs this week and next. Some of the local stories we've been following for you on this Tuesday. Local news first at 1110 AM WCCM and 102.9 FM HD2.